Kentucky. All right, so look. So let, let's just talk about some of the stuff we have. First of all, I want to thank you for this yep. SBIDX. I feel like we should fire it up, but I don't have the right connector. No, no, the e everything is the, the connector. Connector? Should we fire it up? Yeah. Let's do it. All right. Let me get uh, an option from there to the DC jack. Okay, and I'll, I'll open it up here. So the reason why we have this connector is called an XC60. This is very, you know, common so with the aero modulars. So you can't reverse, so you, can, you can't put it in backwards. Yeah, no. The other thing is this comes with, I mean, you can slap an aero, uh, a drone battery here. Oh, wow. And that's got this connector. But also I like the connector too, because yeah, you, can, can't, you can't do reverse. Yeah, yeah, you you yeah, can't yeah. damage it. So let me see. Um, okay, so we, let's use this, this supply. No, wait a yeah. second. I have, I have a supply here with the right connector. Okay. Yeah, so this here. Ah, look. This is, this puts out about about thirteen point eight. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah, thirteen point eight. This will go like this. Turn it on. I don't want to blow it up. No, so no, nothing. Like that. Yeah. Okay. Turn it on. And then it's got a it's got a reverse diode protector. Oh, it's got in there. Okay. All right. Let's see. <clears throat> Hope my connector's good. Yeah. Oh, look at that, man. Wait a second, we gotta hook up the antenna too. Yeah, that's the antenna. Done. <coughs> Let me get my award that you brought me back in 2017. <laughs> the, put the antenna on. The one that they had withdrawn. That was good. All okay. right, all right. Now look. First, you can see the tubes here. Oh, you got the beautiful so, tubes in there. So, <laughs> so, a lot of people confuse it, thinking that there's actually a tube inside it. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta show a look. Look, look, Grayson, Grayson, it's filled with tubes. It's good. They're, they're not tubes, they're thermotrons. Thermotrons. <laughs> All right. All right. So wait, let's get it. Let's get the antenna. So now, look, this is my system. So okay. this right now is coming through here. Okay. But I got to put the antenna over on the bench. Should we go with the hex beam? And yeah, nothing's I... on the hex beam right now. It's going 40 meters. Okay. 40 meters is probably Can you give me a, a star head screwdriver? There's a... What do you need? A regular, a straight screwdriver? Straight anything, you know, something that oh, I can... Oh, hex. Okay. Yeah. It's a star, yeah. No, 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 look, you know, I pull out the one... There you go, there you go. You know, by the way, I've uh, learned one thing from my dentist friends. I got one of these IKEA trays uh -huh. in which I lay everything out. So, you know, the first section is screwdrivers, then stuff that you can hold with, like flyers, and the last is uh, things you can cut with. All right, well, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but you know, I mean, one thing I've learned about bigger than this. No big, let's see, hold on. Hold on, I got one, one hand over here. This is my other part of the organization over here. Look here. Look here. Good, oh, good, wow. Good. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> okay. I mean, this is just a hack, but nevertheless, it's a. So, this is where you can connect it to an external monitor if you want. But all you do is. Yeah. That's okay. okay. Well, okay, good. Yeah, right. good. Do you have internet? You know? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, let me, I, I... Or Ethernet. Okay. We can do that later, don't worry. Oh, okay. okay, we'll just fire it up. Yeah. Look at so, beautiful thing. The, the new SBTX, okay? Uh -huh. uh, this is the old one, right? Right. But if you just wait, you can actually operate it from the browser. And the reason why we do that is that, you know, the, the user interface is so much easier, right? Wow, look at that. Yeah. And. Hold on, I'm gonna bring the camera over here. Yeah. What's your uh, grid? What do you mean? N2 CQR. Yeah, no, no. Uh, oh, go. Oh, 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 where are it? Hold on. I uh, always keep forgetting my own. Yeah, F. Uh, 
Hmm. I think it's FM 18 JV. FM 18? 18 JV. JV? FM 18. JV. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So now here, it's actually decoding this because there's FLDG running in the background. That is really fantastic. I feel myself being pulled in by the... Uh, <laughs> yeah, lure of... Uh, <laughs> and you know... The, the, by the waterfall. The waterfall the, is oh, calling yeah. me. Yeah. Um, and you know, what you could do is... Let me just move to an empty spot. Now that we have put your call sign in already, right? Right. And then you can go into the macros and just do that. <laughs> 12 words per minute, too. Yeah. And if you look at the the shaping right it's it's a perfect what's oops what happened something's tripped here i i, I blew the, it blew the fuse it was calling a little bit too much I, oh I, my, my power supply is, is limited oh, oh okay. man i'm sorry no no that's fine that's fine all right well that's, that's excellent yeah, I, 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 hear the... yeah, I heard the i heard the the the, 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 the click this, on the on the power supply about 600 to 700 milliamps all right, yeah, I was probably pulling a little bit too more for this supply. But that's all right. We can, you know, get to that later. All right, well, excellent. <laughs> <laughs> Let me make sure we got a point of that. Yeah. So, uh, so you're taking orders on it now? Of course, yeah. All right, so off yeah. to Dayton you go, and you're going to show off yeah. this thing, too. I mean, Dayton, we have got about, you know, 30, 40 of these to be sold. So you could actually put the HDMI from in here. Mm -hmm. But the most amazing part here is that it's on Wi-Fi, right? So you saw the browser. Mm -hmm. You could equally open the browser on your phone and operate from there. So, you know. Let me just reset this thing. Okay. There we go. Fire it up again. Yeah. But or it's if a, you have Ethernet, you know, you could connect it to that. Yeah, you could, you could connect it there. Yeah, it'll, it'll fire up there. It's firing up. Look at that. For that, you'll require uh, uh, to add a keyboard to it so that we can configure the Wi Fi. Yeah. <clears throat> But no, it's been fantastic. And we'll just go, go all run from my phone. I'll be down a minute. Yeah, but, and, and the thing is, uh, inside it, it's a regular super head. So it's not that, you know. I, I remember when you did the original video. Yeah. yeah. All right. And, and you were talking about um, how it is just sort of a, let me mess up a little bit here for us. Yeah. How, it, how it is just, an, uh, the architecture is sort of a combination. It's, yeah. it's, yeah. it's not, not, not all SDR. It's not just an yeah. analog yeah. and digital yeah. converter. Yeah. His, his 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 tubes the tubes are still there, Grayson. <laughs> the filaments are burning. Yeah. And there's FLDG which runs in the background in any case. Um, and you know one of the things which I've taken care of here is that it can used by people who have <clears throat> uh, what's called as eyes free operation so you can actually operate this without looking at it this is for people you know who are visually impaired right so it's a, it can work as a text only set i set to uh, okay let me actually go back to the web it's easier okay one There they are, our friends. Yeah. <laughs> the sound of evil. Yeah, okay. the sound of evil. <laughs> and you can actually tune it from here too. This is actually better, it works better than a physical knob. Unfortunately, you don't. <laughs> get a closer look here, hold on. We are not sure whether the clock is synchronized. The clock has to synchronize well, right? So if the clock synchronizes, then it works very well. See, it should have actually decoded this. Uh, 15, yeah. Okay. So you see this thing going, right? Yeah. Uh, 20, 21, or whatever. At 30, it'll stop. And then it'll have the decode out. <clears throat> you must have tremendous fun putting this together. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. yeah, yeah. I mean, this is a long way from the uh, yeah. the DC receiver that you did so long ago with your, with your with your cousin who was in the I know, DC I know, program. I know, I know. But you know, the thing is that a lot of things are still the same. I mean, fundamentally, they are the same. There. Oh, uh, there's all there's all the decodes and everything yeah. else. Wow, I could be I could be working DX as I sleep. This is fantastic. <laughs> I mean, you can actually. I don't want to trigger this 
you know, transmit now because it will trip this. Yeah. But you just click on one of these CQs and sit back. That's all. It will even log it into the logbook. So I already all, 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 you know, have a logbook here as well. So. Wow. <clears throat> so that's the, I mean, you, you could, let's see. Actually, this is not very interesting. Let's go back to CW. Okay. And go to a very small step away. And you know, actually, this is this all comes for free in an SDR, right? For example, I can. Uh, okay, I'm on a tape. Sorry, it won't allow you to. Okay. So now it's completely gone because you know, it's. it's... Oh, I sorry, sorry, I have changed the step to one megahertz. There you are. You know, I can see with the with the water mm -hmm. ball. This is why guys yeah. will sometimes tell me that I'm 20 hertz off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is that there's no ringing because it's a digital filter, right? right? So you you could hear, you know, keep hearing this for hours without a problem. Without it ringing, you can you yeah. set it. How, what's the narrowest you can set the filter? Uh, um, that would be I think 100. Let me just see. Yeah, that, that's that's right now. And, and you, you know, you just go off a little, and it's gone. That's it. So actually, if if this was you know vertical, you could actually read the CW. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's yeah. That's what you know. It does it. The schema. Beautiful. Thanks. Thanks for bringing this for us. Yeah. Wow, that's, that's amazing. Yeah, it's gonna. I think I'm sure and it's, it's got gonna a zip rod meter and built, so you know you can just connect it to some wire. It's actually it it's actually smaller than my Rigol scope. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. So yeah, yeah the same. Yeah. Same kind of footprint there. Right. <laughs> right. And it's actually you know I mean okay let me do this, but this will probably trigger it. But you can actually send CW from here. You, know, you could just I can put a different power supply on it so it yeah I, it. I'm just telling you that and yeah. this is the interesting part so you say telnet okay there the telnet and start so oh there's there's no internet otherwise you could actually see the call sign streaming here like a ticker tape wow <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> fantastic anyway but I mean this is there's nothing new with the core for radio in this, it's basically, you know, things that you put on top of the radio to make it fun. I mean, the CW is still the same CW, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. This still the same well, crystal filter there. Well, well this is, the, this is the, the thing that I th that strikes me about CW. So you've got this all this sophisticated yeah, technology. Yeah, but it's back to the CW. And, 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 and somebody's the just turning the thing on and off. Yeah. I mean, that, like, like and I was somebody doing, could be, you know, <laughs> That's literally wires what, what, what I was doing, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Anyhow. <clears throat> Yeah, turn something up. Let me let me show you some of the some of the other stuff here that we thought. Yeah. Okay. But thank you for this. This is amazing. Got to put the screw back here. Yes. There we go. Let's see if it does right this time. This one's good. There's also an inbuilt uh, mic in case you're not carrying a microphone. Oh my gosh! Well, yeah. It's a, <laughs> this is really beautiful. Thank you. Thank you for bringing it. <clears throat> let me take this off here before we. I don't want to blow anything up. So let me put this back. This is your. This is um, this is yeah, I'll this, see this, put this this one yeah. back. This is the uh, the vid the vidx. But this I want to show you the um, the receiver. Mm -hmm. let me put this all, keep this, this all one? together. This is the receiver yeah, that yeah. we built. But yeah. I, I brought this out to show. This is when Farhan brought me the plaque. Yeah. This is the one here to return because he what ran seven watts. No, so, that was Pete. Pete, Pete, Pete had Pete. to turn himself in. <laughs> Pete had to, <laughs> That was another April first story. <laughs> We were being, being prosecuted or persecuted by the QRPI or OCI. <laughs> Let me bring this over here so we can, yeah. we can show you. Actually, I mean, who wants to see us? They want to see the, the, oh, the videos. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's right. Yeah, but let, so let's, let's focus here. Let me see if I get this here. Yeah. Get this on. Let me get this all right, like this. Okay. So we have here a completely a radio at the other end of the spectrum. Right. All right. This is the, this is the direct conversion receiver. That we've been working on. Let me put the antenna because this too is on, on forty meters. And wait a second. I think I had a, I had a little battery. 
I had a battery. Five volts battery. I have a battery, but I can power it up with this thing here. I'll live a little bit dangerously. I think my battery must have fallen down somewhere. Mm. But we'll go like this here. Look. I don't even. I don't. I. I don't have any reverse polarity protection on this thing. Oh. Oh man. That's good. Okay. Yeah. So now look. Wait a second. This is the frequency calibration we Okay. Okay. And then what you have to do is you put it, and I've calibrated it, oh, so a little bit like that. And then you, what, to figure out what frequency you're on, you have to look almost vertically down and see okay. where this thing lines up. Oh, okay. So let's go down to, we were, you were in the CW portion of the yeah, van. Yeah, So we'll go down here. Good, they can see this here. But I'll show you how nicely this thing works. Mm. Digital stuff? Mm -hmm. No, that's not FT8. Not FT8, but something else digital. Mm -hmm. Look at the speaker. Yeah, yeah. It's actually pretty good as a speaker for that size. I think it's pretty stable. Try yeah, turning a little bit, try. <laughs> Turn yeah. the screw. You go through zero beat. Yeah. Go to the other side. <laughs> Direct conversion. Yeah. So, you know. Okay. So, we can you just bring the camera over so that we can you yeah, know, look at take what's a look. here? Hold on. Let me. I got to put the. Put it, make sure. I got the camera on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> let me flip it around.